Hello guys, hope you're having a fabulous day and welcome back to another Citrix Lab Setup series and this is going to be part 5 and in this video we are going to install all the Citrix Core components on our CTX Core server. Let's get started. So uh, this is my CTX Core server and I have copied the setup to the folder 715 setup. And we are going to install a 7.15 LTSR. So let's mount it. So let's right click on auto select and run as administrator. Yes. And we are going to select the Zen desktop. It comes with applications as well as desktops. So click on start. So in this window, you will see uh, multiple options. So if you are getting started, it's going to be with delivery controller. And we also do have uh, options for installing VDA. And in the extend deployment window, you have Citrix Director, License Server, Store Fan, Studio, and all the additional uh, deployments. So it's all comes with the same package. So let's get started with the delivery controller. Okay, uh, let's click on accepting the terms of the license agreement, click next and the core components, yes, we are going to install all of them uh, on the same server. So delivery controller, studio, director, license server, storefront, all are going to be in the same server, click next. So here uh, we are given option to install SQL Server 2014 SP2 Express but we don't need it because in the previous video we have already installed SQL Server Express 2019 so we don't need this and when it comes to uh, Windows Remote Assistance uh, as you can see select this only if you need the shadowing feature of Director Server since uh, I'm installing Director as well and uh, I'm going to keep this selected click next firewall rules i'm going to uh, keep automatically configured and these are all the ports that will be required for the setup and click next so these are all the prerequisites core components features and firewalls just a summary of what we are getting ourselves into click on next i'm sorry click on install It will take few moments uh, to start the installation. Let me just expand pre-rook sites. So let me just fast forward it. So you don't need to wait until it install each and everything. So it takes a long time. So I'm just going to first forward it to the completion. Okay. All the core components are installed now. So next will be the post installation action and that will be component initialization. Okay. Components are initialized and I do not want to connect to smart tools. Then click next. okay so as soon as i click on finish a studio will be launched but that's for the next video so i'm gonna uncheck then click on finish so let's just take a recap in the previous video we have installed sql express on our ctx core and we granted the required permissions for site db creation and in this video we have installed all the citrix core components and in the next video, we are going to create a site and we are going to configure it. And if you like this video, please click on like and please do subscribe and do not forget to click on the bell icon. Stay tuned and 
we will meet you again in the next video have a great day bye bye